The Battlefield Rocket Projector, or the MLRS, has proven to be a devastating weapon throughout both minor and major conflicts over the world. They can engage important targets, where the targets could be airfields, command centers, support facilities, air defense and concentration of troops, and so on. In today's video, we would like to present the 10 best multiple rocket launcher systems in the world, so without further delay, let's jump right into it. At number 10 is the SR-5, which is a guided multiple launch rocket system designed and manufactured by Norinco for the People's Liberation Army Forces. The SR-5 is a fully computerized and digitized system with modular design concept to enable both the 122mm rocket series and 220mm rocket series to be adopted on a single chassis using the same fire control and support systems. Rockets are fitted with various warheads including HU frags, incendiary, smoke and illumination. These rockets have different ranges. It can fire satellite-guided rockets with ranges up to 70 kilometers. At number 9 is the Panaka. The Pinaka is a multiple rocket launcher produced in India and developed by DRDO for the Indian Army. It is a multifaceted system integrating high-energy propulsion, submunition warhead, server control launcher configuration and fire control computer. The Pinaka launcher has two pods with 12 tubes for 214mm rockets. The standard rocket is fitted with high explosive fragmentation warhead and the system can fire a salvo of 12 high explosive rockets in 44 seconds. Reloading takes 15 minutes, however, it might be cut to 4 minutes after redesign of the loading platform. At number 8 is the BM-27 Uragan. This is a self-propelled multiple rocket launcher system designed in the Soviet Union. It is capable of launching 220mm rockets from 16 launch tubes mounted on the rear of a ZIL-135 8x8 chassis and a standard rocket is 4.8 meters long and weighs 280 kilograms. The BM-27 can can use high explosive fragmentation, chemical explosive or scatterable mine submunition equipped rockets. The warhead weighs between 90 and 100 kilograms depending on type and a full salvo of 16 rockets can be fired in 20 seconds and can engage targets within a range of 35 kilometers. At number 7, we have the Astros 2. The Artillery Saturation Rocket System is a self-propelled multiple rocket launcher produced in Brazil by the Avibras company. It features modular design and employs rockets with calibers ranging from 127mm to 450mm. The Astros 2 fires four types of rockets. All of these rockets are fitted with high explosive fragmentation warheads and these four rockets include double S-30 rockets, double S-40 rockets, double S-60 and double S-80 extended range rockets. At number 6 is the M142 High Mobility Artillery Rocket System. The M142 High Mobility Artillery Rocket System is a light multiple rocket launcher developed in the late 1990s for the United States Army mounted on a standard Army M1140 truck frame. The High Mobility Artillery Rocket System carries six rockets or one MGM-140 ATA-CMS missile on the U.S. Army's FMTV. The High Mobility Artillery Rocket System fires the same rocket as the M270 Multiple Launch Rocket System. A standard 227mm rocket is 3.96 meters long and weighs 307 kilograms. This multiple launch rocket system fires a full range of M270 rockets including high explosive fragmentation and cluster. At number 5, we have the Lynx, which is a multiple rocket launcher developed and manufactured by Israel Military Industries and used by Israel Defense Forces and other countries. It is capable of firing 122mm BM-21 Grad rockets, 160mm IMI LAR or 200mm IMI Extra rockets. These rockets have a firing range of 21 km, 45 km and 150 km. The IMI Extra rockets can also be fitted with the GPS guidance system for precision strikes. This MLRS system has a fast reaction time and can launch its rockets within several minutes from traveling. Number 4 on the list for the top 10 most powerful MLRS is the WS-2 which is a Chinese multiple launch artillery rocket system that was revealed in 2008. 
It is fitted with six launchers for 400mm artillery rockets. A standard 400mm rocket is 7.3 meters long, weighs 1,285 kilograms, and has a maximum range of fire around 200 kilometers. It can be equipped with various warheads including anti-personnel, anti-armor or fuel-air explosive. These rockets have a simple inertial guidance system. Up next at number 3 is the Polonis Multiple Launch Rocket System, which is a Belarusian 300mm rocket artillery system of a launcher unit comprising 8 rockets packaged in two 4 rocket pods mounted on an MZKT-7930 vehicle. Each rocket weighs 750 kilograms, having combined inertial and GPS guidance, and the range of fire is likely to be 200 kilometers. Launcher is capable of single or salvo firing. It takes 50 seconds to launch a full salvo of eight rockets, and it is claimed that each rocket can be targeted individually, so the Polonis can hit up to eight targets simultaneously. At number two is the 9A52-4 Tornado. This is Russia's newest universal multiple rocket launcher and it was designed as a lightweight and universal version of the BM-30 Smurge. The 9A52-4 Tornado is fitted with a single container with six launching tubes for 300mm rockets. A standard rocket usually weighs 800 kilograms, and this MLRLS can fire all current Smurge rockets including high fragmentation, fuel air explosive, cluster with anti-tank mines. The range of fire varies between 20 km and 90 km. The 9A52-4 can launch rockets singularly by a partial ripple or by a full salvo which can cover an area of 32 hectares. A full salvo can be fired within 20 seconds and this system can be reloaded within 8 minutes. At the number one spot is none other than the M270 MLRS, which is a 227mm rocket artillery system manufactured by Lockheed Martin Missiles and Fire Control. The MLRS is a high-mobility automatic system based on the M270 weapons platform which fires surface-to-surface -surface rockets. A standard 227mm high-fragmentation rocket is 3.96 meters long and weighs 307 kilograms. Ordinary rockets has a firing range of 32 to 70 kilometers, but it can also launch MGM-140 ATACMS tactical missiles, which has a range exceeding 150 kilometers. It has a 120 kilogram warhead and the reloading time of the vehicle is 5 to 10 minutes. And that's it guys for today, we hope you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button so you won't miss out on any of our new videos. Thank you guys for viewing and bye bye!